Hello and welcome to another short tutorial video from Tech Angels. In this week's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can quickly adjust the mouse and keyboard settings on your computer. Start by going to the start icon, clicking control panel, and we will start off by doing the mouse. Simply click the mouse button and you will see appear a little window like this. From here, we're able to adjust a couple of settings. The first one would be switching the left and the right click around, which I do not recommend doing unless you are perhaps left-handed and would really like to have this setting enabled. Or we can change the speed of the double click. For example, if it requires a fast repetition of two clicks, then it will open only if it is done within a short period of time. And if we make it slower, we can test it by there being a shorter delay in which the second click needs to be pressed to open something. This can be very handy if you often find it hard to press the double click in time. We're also able to turn on click lock, which will be a setting where once the click is button is pressed, it will not be released until another click has been pressed afterwards. Again, I do not recommend doing this unless you desperately want the need to do this. We are also able to adjust the speed of the pointer. If you feel as if your mouse moves around too fast, you can change this by this setting and press apply when you are happy. We are also able to display the printer trail as you can see on my screen. When I move the mouse, there are other little mouse icons behind. However, this is sometimes very straining on the eyes and I do not recommend this neither. Another handy little tool is if you lose the mouse sometimes and you have this setting enabled, if you press the control button, the location of the mouse as you will see will be immediately identified by a round circle. This is extremely handy as I find a lot of people tend to lose where the pointer is. We are also able to change the amount of notches it would require for a scroll to take place and the amount of lines it goes down. Adjust this to your suiting with the arrows provided. Once happy, please press apply and OK. Now for the keyboard. Please go back into start, into control panel and press keyboard. The keyboard settings are very simple. The main thing that is concerned with is the delay for repeat and how fast the actual repeat is. For example, if I have an extremely long delay, you will see that when you hold a key down, it will take a while for it to start repeating. And if I was to have it on short, you will see that it will almost instantly start repeating the key. This again depends on your personal preference. The repeat rate is also something which can be changed. For example, I can have a fast delay, however my repeat rate will be a lot slower as you can see. And as we turn it up, it will repeat very much faster. This is very handy and can be very good to fix annoying little mistakes when you try to hold in keys or press them for too long. Once you are happy with your settings, please press apply. There is one last setting called the cursor blink rate, which is just simply the rate at which the cursor on the screen blinks when you are typing. This shouldn't be much of a concern, however, if you wouldn't like it on, this can be done. And if you would like it to blink very fast again, this can also be changed. Again, this is all down to preference. Please press apply when you are ready and then OK. That is all for the mouse and keyboard settings on your computer device. We hope this has helped you gain a bit more customization with how your computer works and we hope that this was very useful for you. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, this is Tech Angels. Goodbye.